anyway, uh, so today I'm gonna go over my top five fall top water lures for striper fishing. Uh, I will have links to all these down in the description below. And here we go, starting with number five is this guy right here. Uh, this is the River to Sea Whopper Plopper. Very, very popular lore and very popular for a good reason. It's because it works. It's not just for bass fishing. You can also catch striper with these. This is number five because it's so simple to use. Like, if I was to fish with, with a uh, beginner, I'll just put this on for them and they'll be able to use it right away. All you guys do is tie it on, cast it out, and reel it back. Uh, the tail is what makes the magic and it makes a real uh, like a plopping noise when it, when it comes when you're retrieving it back. That's why it's called a whopper plopper. But yeah, this is super easy uh, lure to use. You can uh, basically get it anywhere. So this lure comes in all sizes. The earlier versions came with some like crappy treble hooks, but the ones you get now they've upgraded to good hardware, so you don't have to change it out anymore. Uh, comes with a comes in uh, four sizes now, right? So this is the 130 size. Yep, this is the 130. I recommend the 130 or the 110 size. Uh, I also like this color and I also like the bone color and the chrome color. I'm not exactly sure what all the names are, but they all work pretty well. So this is number five, the Wobble Barber. All right. <laughs> Number four, um, this one, this one is basically just a spook style lure that I always keep in my bag um, during the fall run. Uh, the reason why I chose this one right here, this is a Yuzuri pencil, uh, made by Yuzuri, uh, comes with good hardware. The reason why I chose this one, this is a small spook style lure, casts really good. And you can find these in stores as well, like pretty um, readily available now. Um, sometimes the strippers, they do get locked onto like a certain size bait. And a lot of times that means um, you want to throw a smaller bait. And this is why I keep this in my bag. This is a um, smaller spook style. So you basically just cast it out. You walk, walk the dog and bring it back. That's my number four. All right, <clears throat> this is my, right here, this is my number three. And I always keep one of these in my bag because this guy casts a model. And sometimes when you're, if you're, especially when you're shore fishing and the, they're hitting baits way outside of your normal cast range, I put this guy on and I'm usually able to get to him. This is, right here, this is a Gibbs Pro Series. I believe two and a half ounce pencil popper. Um, yeah, baby. I like pencil poppers because you cast it out and it's easy to work. It it's basically walking the dog back while it's spitting water in the front a little bit, and it works really well for strippers, for all size strippers, even the small ones that hit this. So yeah, this is a must have in your bag. Okay, before I get to number two, all right, uh, click that subscribe button and uh, click the bell notification for more fishing videos and lore review videos because we have a whole bunch coming down the pipe right now. And my number two is this guy right here. This is a pencil popper, but it's, it's more of an actual natural popper. So I really like this lore. This is a Tsunami talking popper. So when when I cast this guy out, he has pretty pretty decent as well. Really good cast far casting lore. Um, it is slightly heavier on the back, so it does go pretty far because of that. Uh, I like this lore because when you cast it out and you pop it, it spits a lot of water. And sometimes, um, depending on the stripers, uh, they get really picky, and that extra spinning of the water coming in that would um, entice them to bite so this is that's why this is my number two I'm doing really good this year so far on it so yeah that's number two 
And my all-time favorite go-to number one is another spook style or this is the Yozuri Hydro Pencil. This is a one ounce lore, back weighted, um, comes with good good hardware right out of the box. You don't really need to change anything. Um, I, a lot of times I do modify this, but most of the times I fish it as is right out of the box. Um, really easy to use, cast out, walk the dog it back, and it's very effective. Uh, favorite, my favorite colors so far for all of these is either a chrome, which matches basically any bait fish out there, or a bone colored lure. So I have this in bone as well. So yeah, so that's my number one right there. This is my, uh, my definitely my go-to. Um, so I will have links for all these down in the description below, so check that out. Uh, remember, Christmas is right around the corner and these make excellent gifts. Or birthday kids. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, so check it out and I'll see you guys on the next one. Hey everybody, thanks for watching, but stop freeloading. We need you guys to hit the subscribe button, the like button, and the bell. And be sure to follow us on Instagram and Facebook, and we'll see you guys on the next one.